Hello and welcome to the channel and welcome today to Distance from Refract Studios. This game is currently in early access and I'm going to be checking it out with you guys. I've only played a little bit of this game because I kind of wanted to save a little bit of some of the, the kind of surprises for myself as well so I can kind of share them with you guys. So I've done I think like two levels of an adventure just to kind of get a, a feel for the game. So this game's already got Steam Workshop implementation as well which is pretty cool. Which I think that's only, I think most of the editors and stuff are only to do with if you have it on Steam. But there is DRM free versions as well. So, we're going to jump into an adventure from where I left off so it can kind of give you an idea of the game. I kind of want to describe it as like a sort of runner game. Where you have to get from one end to an end of a level as fast as you can and avoid any kind of dangers. But I don't know if that's quite right. So here is our car anyway. And I will now show you all the craziness that you can do. So you can boost, which will bring out this lovely wall. I mean, some of the effects for your cars on this are fantastic. Now, this game is a little bit trippy. So I will just warn you about that. It, for me, because of how awesome this game actually looks, uh, there's moments where like you'll start randomly driving upside down and things of that nature, and it really throws my, my stomach. Just absolutely insane. So you've got to keep getting these regeneration points, which will regenerate your car, and then horrible things will happen. <laughs> like that. <laughs> so as I said, I haven't done this level, so I have no idea what's coming up. In the previous levels, like there's random like buzz saws that'll just cut your car in half. There's lasers that will do pretty much the same thing. You can randomly start to fly. You start driving up on walls, you start going through portals like we just did then. It's very, very strange, but I found myself having a great deal of fun with it. Nearly overheated a little bit then. Oh, there we go. Now I should be able to fly. There we go. I briefly was tapping the wrong button then. And we just land perfectly and get through another regeneration, which will cool me down. So that light on the back of my car, you've probably already worked out, is the heat generated on my car. Ooh. So you've got to try and watch that. The green rings will give you regeneration, which will fix your car up completely and also reduce that. And off we go again. So as you can see, you can do some pretty cool things. This level... Apart from being a little bit trippy, is a lot nicer than some of the other levels I've had to do. Because so far it hasn't tried to kill me with giant buzzsaws. I say that as I go past one. Or lasers. Oh, here we go, we're getting pulled in. And we're in. Oh, it's very strange. Oh dear. Oh, I don't know if that did anything. I don't know. Let's just boost. So yeah, so far I'm actually really enjoying it. Like, if someone had explained this game to me before... Honestly, I think I'd have probably been like, yeah, it's not for me, honestly. Wrong way. I'm not going the wrong way, am I? Don't confuse me like that. Wrong way, what? Am I going the wrong way? Ah. Oh my god, that just blew my mind. Have I got it? Oh, I've got it. No. That's not a... Huh. Ah. Well, I thought that was a ramp then for a second. So I've gone the wrong way. Oh god, this has just suddenly become really trippy. Okay, let's go this way. It briefly says I'm going the wrong way, and then it says I'm going the right way again. Oh, what? What? I'm so confused. Oh, I can just fly. Oh, I can just fly here. I thought you had to go through the rings to fly. Oh well. Shows how much I know. <laughs> Sorry about that. That was just my complete idiocy kicking in there, clearly. Everything else has been fairly simple up to this point. I didn't think you could literally fly anywhere. I thought you had to be at, like, moments to get over certain obstacles. Oh, now the map's becoming a little bit more, um... See, I thought it was only these parts you could fly in. But, okay, that's kind of cool. So you can just work your way to do different things. Oh, God, I can imagine the light levels being pretty chaotic. Oh, here we go, buzzsaws. Don't want to go through across these. Well, I kind of do to show you how clean the cutting is, but at the same time, I don't want to go through one because I don't really want to die. So, I think we'll just try and avoid them, and I'm sure my idiocy will take over. Let's drive up on the walls because we can, and also because this is about to get really crazy. Oh, actually, that was not that bad at all, thankfully. Okay. <laughs> so, yeah, the levels get... I absolutely love the level design of this game. I really do, and considering this is the early access, so this adventure mode isn't finished, from my understanding. Eventually there's going to be, if I understood this correctly, there's going to be like a full story to it. Oh god, lasers. Ooh, shit, the bed. Whoa, shit. Okay, we're fine, we're fine. The car does handle very well, for anyone who is just kind of wondering. 
Oh shit! And that kind of worked. Oh shit! I can't see. This is holy fuck! I don't know why I pressed jump then. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. Nothing bad is happening. Oh god. Okay, something bad is happening. Do we just go straight on now? Looks like it. Whoa! It's really strange. I absolutely love it, but this... Oh, here we go. This is the end of the level. There we go. So that was one level. <laughs> As I say, they, get, they start to get a bit strange. Oh, it looks like I get a choice of sector now. Or maybe I would have, possibly. Or maybe that's a thing that's about to be added. I don't know. I just don't know. We'll try and do one more level, and then I think that'll go. Oh sh! <laughs> would probably help if I actually jump there. There you go. That really would help. Okay, so they're hiding jumps a little bit more now. Okay, we're gonna be fine. We're gonna be fine. Oh, it's such a smooth game. It's unbelievably smooth. I mean, bearing in mind, I am also. Ru like using fraps to record this, which is pretty intensive on your system. Like fraps is pretty processor heavy, so sometimes it does have pretty nasty effects on games. It tends to drop the frame rate quite quite significantly. And I mean this is still running absolutely solid for me. It's just barely taking a knock at all. It just looks absolutely stunning. I absolutely love this design. It's such a simple game and yet I'm having just so much fun with it. It's insane. It's just too good. That's a jump. That is a jump, my friend. You might want to take a note. That is a jump. Whoa. I love the sheer speed you can get. It's pretty, pretty cool. Getting through some of these crazy obstacles at just high speed is just immensely satisfying. Just, it's those weird moments as well, particularly in the first few levels when all of a sudden it was like, oh, if you press jump again, you'll fly. And I was just like, I'm sorry. <laughs> I can fly now? It was really cool. Oh. Uh, okay, so now I can... Oh, this is one of the other things you could do. You could, like, rotate and stuff. Uh, uh, oh, God, this is really strange. Okay, there we go. There we go. Okay. Oh, oh. I'd completely lost track of my buttons then. Just completely. Oh, it looks like I need to stay flying in this area. Or I could just crash into the big circle. Okay, just stay calm. Okay, fly. Up there from the looks of it. It's weird how like all the music stops in this area. It's very oh good god, we're straight back in. It's very strange. Oh, they, these are the ones that kind of mess me up now because uh, press right to jump off a wall and rotate onto a wall. Huh? What? Oh good god! How very very interesting. So now we do. So we go along here, and then. <laughs> okay, or not. The control's a bit strange, honestly. So you do that. What, and then jump? And that just flipped me. It's fine. It's fine you didn't say that. It's alright. <laughs> Don't worry about it. Nothing happened. Oh god, lasers. Lasers are bad. Lasers are bad. Lasers are bad. <laughs> Holy moly. Input corrupted, so I'm not allowed to fly in that particular part. You do that, and then jump. Oh, damn. That's really hard. So you have to do that, then jump, and then try and... Oh my god. That's really hard to do. I know there's going to be people like, no, it's not, you're just an idiot, but... Believe me, that is pretty tr Oh my god, that's really difficult to do. Okay. Getting off, not so bad. Okay, let's try it again. Oh, okay, there we go. 
I kind of have to put my hands in very strange ways to actually do that though. I have to kind of put two thumbs over to the one side of the controller, because again, I'm, I'm using a controller for this because I'm a scrub. Oh no! <laughs> ah. Okay. It just threw me then. There we go. Oh, it's very, very strange. Uh. Are we near the end? Maybe. I don't know anymore. We might be near the end, we might not be. Let's get some speed back up. I've been doing this a bit too slow. Yeah, there we go. We have an end. I thought it was going a bit long. Damn, those wall jump things are really awkward. <laughs> oh. So yeah, that is basically distance. And I think, for now, I'm going to stop here. I, for now, I'm not going to do any more of this game. If you guys want to see any more, you can let me know, and I'll carry on from here. If I don't hear anything in a couple of days, I'll probably just carry on playing it for myself, because I want to do some more, because I'm actually really enjoying this. So, you guys can let me know. This has been a little look at Distance by Refract. Bear, please also bear in mind, it does say in the top as well, this is early access, it's beta, it's not finished. Things can change, things can get added, things can be fixed. So... I personally think the game's solid. I haven't encountered any problems yet. All I know is that there's certain features that aren't in the game yet that need to be added. That's all I know. So, yeah. Hopefully you guys enjoyed this. Oh, other thing. The music for this game is awesome. So, that's another good thing. Um, so, yeah. Hopefully you guys enjoyed this. If you did, do let me know. Drop me likes, drop me comments, and subscribe if you haven't already. Thank you very much, and hopefully I will see you soon. Bye-bye.